WHM and WKHM.com. I'm Jenny Lewis. Thank you, Jenny Lewis. You're welcome. Thank you welcome. so much. Great job. Thank you, Hefe Kensel. Good morning, sir. Look at that. He found his way back. Oh, yeah. We, we just had to get rid of uh, the sun. Really? Uh, right. That's what we needed to do. Well, that and leave the door unlocked. I, I keep checking. Oh, oh well. Yeah. I thought it was the breadcrumbs. Did you leave out breadcrumbs? No. It's no. I thought you were. I thought we talked about He's that. He's on I a low you carb were... diet. It's cereal, oh. cereal crumbs anyway. Oh, That's cereal what crumbs. Is. Got it. Just small pieces of Captain Crunch. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Littered throughout the county. We found him eventually. Yeah. News update brought to you this time around by Once Upon a Child. Once Upon a Child is a parent's best kept secret. Stop in today. Sell your gently used name brand kids clothing, shoes, toys, and equipment for cash on the spot. Visit onceuponachildjacksonmi.com for more information. Someone keeps touching my cameras. Not oh. good at all. Round one. Fight. I'm going to bring on. I'm going to get it. Dustin for Prince. That's right. It's going to happen. All right, sports brought to you by Trips Auto Shop and Collision Centers. The right repair, no accident at Trips Auto Shop and Collision, serving you since 1988. Tigers in action last night. They downed the Brewers one to nothing. The final score there. Nice. Tigers are a baseball team. Just in case you didn't know, football teams, however, are going to be action on Friday. Ipsy takes on Jackson High. Ipsy coming in at 0 and 3. Jackson's 1 and 2. We'll have live coverage for you down the hallway. WKHM, Jackson's News Talk, 970 AM, 101.5 FM. And then right here on K105.3, we'll have Hanover Horton at Grass Lake. One and two Hanover Horton taking on one and two Grass Lake. We'll be right here on K105.3. Michigan State's got University of uh, Miami, Florida. And who does UM have? U of M has Northern Illinois. Both kickoffs at noon this Saturday. There you go. There's your sports. Your forecast now brought to you by My Retirement Plan, and that is Firekeepers Casino Hotel. Win a share of $170,000 in cash and prizes on Saturday, September 25th at Firekeepers Casino Hotel. Visit firekeeperscasino.com for details. I'll do that when I have a moment. Do Please. I have to do it right now? Not right this second. Okay. Maybe but after I will the visit. Sh- yeah, maybe after the show. After? Mm-hmm. What about during a long commercial break? Ooh, even better. Work? Can okay. we find out if we win sooner? I don't know, yeah. So many questions. Why don't we just go to Firekeepers? Okay. Well, let Greg O'Connor will complete the morning show. Perfect. Road Are trip. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Road trip. Greg O'Connor, I tell you what, one of the biggest aficionados of Britney Spears I've ever seen in my life. Really? Truly. Yeah. Wow, I had no idea. Yep. And uh, loves Ross Common. That's just a few of the things about, about Greg O'Connor. Not okay. a lot of people know. Wow. Huge Ross Common fan. <laughs> uh, forecast. Firekeepers? We, we did that, yeah. yeah. I right. saw it run by the window. 76 <laughs> the high today, partly sunny skies. Partly cloudy tonight, low 53, and mostly sunny Thursday with a high reaching 79 degrees. Currently in Jackson, fair skies. We're at 61 degrees. Roll in and win big at Firekeepers this September. <laughs> It's the Roll It Rich Cash Giveaway on Saturday, September 25th. Slots and table games players can play our dice game to win a share of $170,000 in cash and prizes. Every two hours from 2 p.m. to 8 p.m., three players will each win $5,000 in Red Hot credits. Plus, they'll each get to roll the dice three times for a bonus prize of up to $5,000 cash. Then at 10 p.m., it's the grand prize drawing, where one winner gets $25,000 cash, plus three bonus dice rolls for a chance at an additional $25,000. Earn entries all month, and don't miss the Roll It Rich Cash Giveaway on September 25th. Michigan's best casino experience is hotter than ever. Get your Vegas on at Firekeepers Casino Hotel. I-94 to exit 104 in Battle Creek. Management reserves all rights. Here we go, our number one Wednesday edition. Hefe's back. We finally found him. Yeah. We sent out a search party that included what wasn't limited to Carrot Top. (laughs) (laughs) Ouch. Ron Howard. Was he and there? Ron Howard. Wow. Thank you, Jenny Lewis. <laughs> Ron Howard is the grand poobah of gingers. Is he? He is. He's up there. Huh. Glad I know now. Now I know. And I'm no glad he got to keep his card since he lost his hair. You know? 
Ouch. That was not. I don't want, Ouch. I'm wow. just saying. I felt a, a that ginger, one over here. A ginger is still a ginger, that, even if they don't have hair. Yeah, it's that's, right. Just as as your court appointed attorney, stop talking. Stop talking. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right, we got a big show coming up for you, including a man who stole a pooper scooper. <laughs> oh, gee. As a wise man once said, you can't make this stuff up. No. <laughs> let's get it kicked off, though. We do have a few clouds in the area today, so let's do some tones and I. This is Cloudy Day, K105.3. Good morning. Am I living? <laughs> Did you get some new ears? I did. New ears. New cans. Oh, I see. New headphones. Turn it up so I can hear it in my headphones. I got no trouble in my headphones. Because it's all about the bass. (laughs) Thank you, because that's exactly where I was going. That's what was happening in my head. Thank you. Sad I was there. You were. Yeah, yeah. You didn't make it out alive no, or unscathed. Well, unscathed. alive, but there's Band-Aids. <laughs> Always. You got a limp now. <laughs> <laughs> make it inside any of our heads, you coming out with a limp. Uh-huh. Yeah. Here's, here's a valid question, I feel. Okay. Um, taking issue with some of the appointments that we've made on this show this morning. Rusty Jones wants to know, or actually says, thought Lucille Ball was the grand poobah of gingers. Oh. Now, I think she might be the grand ma poobah. Mm. Yeah, I agree with that. There's you. There's different sections, you know. You, Lucille Ball is up there, though. She's on the higher court. There's no doubt. Rusty, good point. But Ron Howard makes it in with the Star Wars connection, and... He's just, he was, he went into the nerdy redhead and then came out genius. So he's traveled full circle. So I guess, yeah, he does have Star Wars credit to his name, but Mm. you don't like the movie he directed. Well, true, but he, like I said, he, he's gone. Have you watched that? I have watched it. And rewatched it. Yes, I've rewatched it. And it's better the second time around, isn't it? I didn't say that. You did. It is. Ooh. I struggle. You know I struggle with those. They're just I don't like a I don't like a money grab movie. You know? It's But by that logic you can't like Layer the Cable Guy. Because that whole thing is just a money grab. His whole skit or the movies? His I don't watch any, I don't watch any of his Everything. movies. God, I don't have that much wasted time. <laughs> It's a cloudy day. That's why we can have them here. <laughs> here he is, live in studio, representing the Ginger Coalition of America after a two-week absence to reapply zinc across his entire body <laughs> so that it could soak into his pores and he could once again become a day walker. Yay. Ladies and gentlemen, Hefe Kinsel. Oh, thank you, thank you. It is great to be back. It's great to be back that Sometimes that day job takes us over. Yeah. And but snuck out this morning. I want I'm glad you're here because I've been hanging on to this story oh. for a while. Coming up for you this morning, we'll call it 615. We're going to discuss a man who stole a pooper scooper. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be a good one. Well. Wow. A pooper scooper. A pooper scooper. A man. That okay. stole a pooper scooper. Okay. Uh, but we do have to say hello once again to the man, the myth, the legend himself, F.A. Kinsel. Jenny Lewis is here as well. Good morning. And if you'd like to see the masters that are our lighting technicians, we've actually made Hefe stand out against a nearly white wall. You can <laughs> see that on YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook. Jackson Tip Music, K105.3. Make sure you watch our live video feed there. All right, 6.15. Why I'm ready. I just can't wait. Man who steals pooper scooper. Yeah. So many things running through my head. I just like saying pooper scooper. <laughs> say it, then say it again. <laughs> Go ahead. Get it out. A pooper scooper. <laughs> you said a pooper scooper? Pooper scooper. 
Why'd you throw the ah in there beforehand? I felt like it needed it. A pooper scooper? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pooper scooper. So that makes it singular. Boy, I tell so you what's what. The who's plural? walking around with multiple pooper scoopers? Well, if you're carrying two pooper scoopers and you don't, because yeah. you need one hand for the dog. Right. So right. You're otherwise, just a weird guy. Otherwise, <laughs> that's a really big dog. <laughs> oh. No, thank you. I like to just walk around with bags of poop in my hand. <laughs> No dog. Just bags of poop. It's still poop a, again. Still, a think, think of what that dog's thinking. Yeah, I'm going to give you something to carry. You know? It's... I think they should carry it, actually. <laughs> no. Just tie it around their collar. You know what I'm thinking? How many calls from elementary schools we're going to be responsible for someone going, do you know how many times your child said pooper scooper this morning? There's that one weird kid that's going, a oh, pooper scooper. A oh, pooper scooper. Oh. Uh. Pooper scooper. Oh, A, A. <laughs> and there's the, the, the grammar thing. A pooper scooper. <laughs> we aren't heathens. Sorry, Mrs. Lawson. <laughs> 13 minutes after 6 o'clock. Scott Clown. Jackson's hit music. K105.3. I feel like trying to figure out why it would be a waste of time. I don't know what happened. I love this song. Absolutely. I'm going to give you a little bit. I love this song, though. Human Elton John. Where do you go next? You know, as Dua Lipa and her partnership with Elton John, how do you, where do you go? Did you see um, Elton John? Well, Metallica was on Howard Stern Show. Oh. And the, the, the video interview's out, but. Elton John came on because Metallica's got that tribute album where everybody's doing covers of mm-hmm. okay, their stuff. Miley did Enter Sandman, I think. No, Stapleton, I think, did Enter Sandman. Really? Chris Stapleton did a Metallica song. He did. But um, Elton John was in the interview, and James Hetfield and all the Metallica are there. And Elton John says during the interview, you know, you guys aren't just hard rock. You guys are incredibly talented musicians. You are the best at doing what you do. This from Elton John? And James Hetfield wipes tears from his eyes. It wow. was... Wow. I mean, because you look at Hetfield, man. He's the... Yeah, yeah. But to have Elton John, which made me think, what does Metallica mm. listen to in their tour bus? Are they like, hey... Give Flip me... over to the B side of Boy George, would you? <laughs> I mean, are they doing Karma Chameleon? Are they... I love this one. <laughs> That's my jam. <laughs> I guess I always pictured them listening to like Prong and 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 maybe like Disturbed. Yeah. Or five, Alice Cooper. Five but... Finger Death Punch. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I did. Five s- Finger Death Punch. There's a couple of really good songs actually. Oh no, they're tremendous. They're in my workout playlist. It's uh. There's a couple really good songs. Hmm. Um, I did see Elton John in concert when he was touring with Billy Joel. Oh, man. And it was a phenomenal show. The curtain opened up, and there were two grand pianos on the stage, the British flag over one and the American flag over the other. Each came out for 45 minutes, and then they came out for 45 minutes together. Just an amazing show. That's insane. I would love to see that show. Of course, it'll never happen again. But no. I'd love to see Billy Joel in, uh... oh, the park in New York. Why can't I? Uh, why can't Central I park? Central park? Yep. The well, park there, a lot of these guys are doing the, are doing the My Accountant Ripped Me Off tours. <laughs> <laughs> I believe. Uh, the German expression for that is Leonard Skinner. <laughs> I believe that. Yes. How they find that now? <laughs> Elton John, Dua Lipa. How giddy is Dua Lipa to have her name mentioned right after Elton John's now? Wow. She better be. Sir Elton John. I apologize. Yes. Sir Elton John. He didn't go to night school for me to call him Elton. <laughs> Sir. 15 years of night school. 
I believe it was just like a 20-minute ceremony. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. It's like an honorary doctorate. A little sword on each shoulder. Yep. Rise! <laughs> Help him up. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> 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 Michigan dad getting up after yeah. being knighted. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's well, a long free. way up. <laughs> nope, I'll be down here if you need me. <laughs> this is my new home. <laughs> yes. I'll live here. <laughs> Got a beautiful castle. Got a pillow for my other name. Um, so anyway, I, I'm really late with this, but I can't imagine anyone breaking into my home. Have you ever had your home broken into? No, okay. thank God. Jenny? Uh, my garage, it. yes. You had your garage broken. you got to feel violated. I do. It was scary. Sc- yeah. Mm-hmm. In all seriousness, that's scary. Well, uh, according to Pasadena now, obviously Pasadena, Florida. This is a past article, though. You can't though say, it obviously, Pasadena. it could be Pasadena, California. That's what I said, Pasadena, California. You said, you said Pasadena, Florida. Florida. Did I? Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. Pasadena, Florida, California. Excuse me. Right. I'm so sorry. Well, I didn't I'm know so if sorry. there was a Pasadena, Florida. Maybe. Uh, there probably is. All right. Besides. I mean, there's a Miami, Ohio. Like yeah. anyone fell for that. False advertising. <laughs> Thank you, yeah. His last name is Ohio. It all went down Sunday night. Two residents called police after hearing noises from inside their home. And as it turns out, there was someone in their home. They did steal something. That culprit did steal a pooper scooper. Oh. It had to be one fancy pooper scooper. Well, right. uh, intruder spotted leaving the property with stolen pooper scooper, later found at a nearby grocery store. William Martin Aston, 62, was booked on suspicion of burglary with bail set at $50,000. Holy moly. That's the most expensive pooper scooper ever. Well, he's in some deep poo. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they were going to let him off, you know, for stealing the pooper scooper. They were just going to say, hey, listen, what's the matter with you? They, they should send him to like the fourth floor somewhere. Uh, some mental facility, but the fifty thousand dollar bail tells me that he was running. He was talking crap. That's. <laughs> well, can you imagine that conversation in the jail? So, what are you in for? <laughs> <laughs> no street cred there at all. None. No. Stole a pooper scooper. No. Of all the things that he could have stolen. <laughs> did they? Did the owners have to identify the pooper scooper thief? <laughs> take in take a it out of a lineup. <laughs> yes. And, and did they have to have everybody hold the pooper scooper? <laughs> Turn to the left. Yeah. <laughs> That's him. <laughs> well, the homeowners obviously traumatized, but they're okay now. Um, but basically, they just said, you know, he won't be taking crap from anyone. From right now, so he's going to go up in prison for a long time. <laughs> Such a waste. <laughs> Scott Cloud, Jenny Lewis, the K105.3 Morning Show. Okay. Over there. Oh. Wow. Nice. Oh, thank you. Whew. That was a good one. <laughs> that was a good one. It was a good one. <laughs> hmm. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we got the Right? I can't remember. There was a pretty good skit on somebody's first days on SNL. And they were scared to death. And they were trying to, you know, work their way through the first week. And somebody told them, stay away from him. <laughs> he's the craziest one on here. And they're like, no, he's so quiet, you know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> quiet. Yeah. It's a big hat. It's funny. Oh, one of my favorites. Coco. Gories are potent potables, sharp things, movies that start with the word Jaws, <laughs> a petite déjeuner, that category is about French phrases, so let's just skip it. Hey, uh, I speak a little French, you're an ass bite, pardon my French. <laughs> my name's French. Yeah, well, who gives a damn? Moving on. 
animal sounds, Sean Connery condiments, uh, and finally, your ass or a hole in the ground. <laughs> Simple. I know you can do this. <coughs> Let's start with French Stewart, who's grinning like a... <coughs> Come on, that is way out of line. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my gosh. And Norm MacDonald. <coughs> oh, Nick wants to know if we had a... Uh, Put it right on up there. I have the technology to do this so that you can read it as well. That's right. You didn't know there'd be a test. So did Jeff go do anything fun or have a good story to come back with? Or we just get Hefe and, and that's that. Listen, I don't know why you're curious about why where Hefe was. Who's asking you about that? If anybody in a suit asks you, you don't know. You know nothing. You didn't see me. <laughs> Getting a little nosy, aren't we? See, gingers get nosy with each other. Where were you? Didn't see you on the show. Didn't see it to meeting. Well, they get worried. Okay, it's a tight group, and it's summer. That's so, right. You know, didn't know if somebody burn up there. You know, could be a pile of ash on the ground on, on, the, on a beach with a white flag and nobody's responding. <laughs> Door dashing some, some, some more sunblock. <laughs> In aloe vera. That's right. <laughs> Is there a ginger section on DoorDash? <laughs> <laughs> Nicki Minaj, Starships, K105.3, Jackson Hip Music Station. <laughs> that giggle you hear over there is Hefe Kinsel. The wheezing laugh you hear is that of Jenny Lewis. <laughs> All I mentioned was if there was a ginger section of for redheads, redheads had their own section on DoorDash, and then I put on my headphones and I came back and there's laughter. So, <laughs> did the filter catch something that didn't quite hit the air? Can... I just said all there is is Wendy's. <laughs> Wendy's. It's <laughs> all I got. It's all I got this morning. Well, great job. I know. Jenny's got game today. Oh. She really, oh, she's got game every day. Well, to... she, she backed a truck up every morning. <laughs> every morning when I hear Jenny Lewis pull in, it's boop, boop, boop. She Bring. drives a Ford SUV, but behind it in an invisible trailer, a la the invisible jet of Wonder Woman, mm -hmm. is her trailer full of crazy <laughs> and don't care. It's a cheetah covered and trailer. Game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. It's leopard, How, leopard trailer. True story. <laughs> and rather than having white walls, there are stiletto heels <laughs> in cheetah print yep. that line the outside of the tires. Yep. And there is no tarp. It is simply the world's largest container of Tupperware. <laughs> and all the lids are just mismatched. All and, of them. Like my cupboards. Mm -hmm. <laughs> But she got game. <laughs> she got it. Thank you. <laughs> I was going to ask Suri how to get home from here. I had forgotten where we had gotten. <laughs> How'd we get here? Where are we? Uh, speaking of Siri, there is a new iPhone coming out, and I can't wait to talk to you guys about it. I saw like five, six, seven, eight different. Yeah, there's uh, it's the iPhone 13. It's a beautiful phone. What, what phone do you have over there, Hefe? <laughs> It's an iPhone. I don't hold, hold it up. Hold it up. I'm not an iPhone. Move, move your hand. Does it still have a button? Yeah. No. No. I have no, no button. button. I'm a okay. slidey. I'm so. I'm going to get all technical on you wow. there. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to flip it open anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. <Back> Jeez. <laughs> Window. She's got, she's got there, new, new Target today. She is on. Wow. All right. I mean, I've had like I'm three a, sips of caffeine, I'm so I don't roll, know what's happening. i got to roll my sleeves up because this Jeff. is going to be on here. In a minute. It's on. Did you have some Activia yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> Activia. I know a guy with a pooper scoop. Right? <laughs> Scott and Jenny. Peace is Scott. Mornings on K105.3. Some of those. <laughs> It's time to fire up the grill with an incredible deal. How about 20 ribeyes for $39.99? Uh, what? You heard me. 20 ribeyes, just $39.99. Prime House Direct is having a gigantic four-day sale. Today through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. Rain or shine. <laughs>
at Menards. 3588 Page Avenue, Jackson. Look for the big truck. And the big tent. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. Cases of fillets, New York strips, Delmonico's, boneless chicken breast, and even large shrimp. With wholesale boxes of individual prime portions. That gives sealed for long freezer life. Bundle up deals that include a free freezer while supplies last. Accepting cash, credit, debit card, and DBT. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. Stop by and register to win our $1,000 prime steak, chicken, pork, and seafood package along with a free freezer. No purchase necessary. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. At Menards. 3588 Page Avenue, Jackson. Today through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. Rain or shine. Brothers Outdoor World's having a veteran celebration this Saturday the 18th from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. at 3055 Springport Road. Celebrate America and our veterans with a day of food, live music, crafters, games, and so much more. You know who opens drains others can't? Miniman Sewer and Drain. Sewer and Drain experts. The only ones you'll call when you have a problem. Because no matter when it is, as always, Miniman Sewer and Drain is there with same-day service. 24-7, 365. Miniman Sewer and Drain will be there on that day you need them. Never hesitate to call. They can fix a problem before it becomes a bigger problem. And they stand by their name and guarantee their work. They open drains that others can't. MinutemanSewer.com. Right now, Art Main is buying vehicles and they are paying big dollars for them. Bring in your current vehicle to trade in for an amazing deal with 0% financing up to 72 months and sign and drive leases on select Chevy. Or just bring it in and sell it to Art Main. You'll be happy you did. Those deals and so much more only at Art Main Chevrolet. Exit 141 Elm Street off I-94. Find new roads at ArtMainChevy.com. Ideal U knows a lot of people are skeptical about weight loss programs, so they're putting their money where their mouth is. Book your free consultation at idealu.us today, and you'll get a free body composition analysis. Plus, they'll give you $100 off the program when you tell them which program failed you in the past. Whatever it is, cabbage soup diet, keto diet, or any program you bought, it doesn't matter. Ideal U will give you $100 off your program. There are no shots, no shakes, and no prepackaged food. Ideal U teaches you how to use real food to lose weight. Act now and you can look the best you have in years long before Halloween. Go to idealu.us and book your free consultation. You'll receive a free body composition analysis and $100 off when you mention any weight loss program that has failed you. That's idealu.us. Results may vary based on physical health and adherence to the program. No weight loss or health guarantees are provided or implied. Do you know a teacher that shows outstanding leadership, true dedication to students, and has gone above and beyond, especially during the pandemic? Jackson Magazine is now accepting nominations for the 2022 Top Teacher Awards. Join True Community Credit Union, Jackson Area Career Center, Stowe Insurance Agency, and Sylvan Learning Center in honoring top teachers in Jackson County. Grant awards are made possible by the Hearst Foundation and the Jackson Community Foundation. Visit jacksonmagazine.com to tell us who you think should be one of next year's top teachers. K105.3 News Now. In the WKHM News Center, I'm Jenny Lewis. The city of Jackson with the Jackson Public Schools will be holding a ribbon cutting ceremony this Friday at 11.30 a.m. for the refurbished pedestrian trail along Emdale Drive. Aaron Dimmick, communication director for the city on WKHM Tuesday, said things will be much safer. We wanted to improve that trail, create a safer walk to school. So it is great for the students, but it's also really great for residents. It's kind of giving them another exercise option and improving that trail. Communication director for the city, Aaron Dimmick. A new delivery service for Kroger. The grocery store chain and Instacart are teaming up, promising grocery deliveries in as little as 30 minutes. It'll be called Kroger Delivery Now. Kroger and Instacart first partnered in 2017 with a two-hour grocery delivery. News and sports powered by WKHM and WKHM.com. I'm Jenny Lewis. Columbia School District is off to a great start. Our STEM courses offer success through hands-on learning. Faculty members are caring educators who give each student the attention they deserve. Our points of pride include a focus on STEM, K-12 music emphasis, art exploratories, online K-12 virtual learning, musical drama productions, and blended learning. When searching for the right environment for your child, look no farther than Columbia Schools at myeagles.org. 
Right now, Larry's RV is stocked up with RVs and floor plans for any size family. Lifetime memories begin with payments starting at $79 a month. Take the first step and fill out the online credit app at Larry'sRVService.com and get pre-approved. Larry's RV offers a free hitch and sway bar with the purchase of any new or used RV. And Larry's inventory is unbeatable with the best in the business for RVs and campers, service and parts, plus camping items you didn't even know you needed. See Larry's RV on Lansing Avenue, where integrity is everything. Thing. K105.3, Jackson's Hit Music Station. Good morning, Scott Cloud, Jenny Lewis, and Hefe Kinsel here with you this morning. Thank you for being along. Let's do a rundown of your forecast now. By the way, your news update brought to you by Columbia School District. Learning today, leading tomorrow. And your forecast now for Larry's RV and Service Center. Larry's RV, where integrity is everything. High today, 76 degrees, partly sunny skies. Is that 50 SPF for you, Hefe? Partly sunny? Partly sunny. Yeah, 50. Okay. Okay. So. Partly cloudy tonight, <laughs> overnight low 53. Mostly sunny tomorrow with a high in the upper 70s. That's like a coat of kills, isn't it? Yeah, it is. You, you're getting serious now. All right. Okay. <laughs> coat of kills. That's why he has his long shirt on today. <laughs> well, you got to get you got to you got to get the gallon of kills. Either that you'll go through 18 small bottles of white out with that tiny brush. <laughs> It's never, never, never works quite well. Enough. It, never enough. <laughs> the applying <laughs> never ends. Start where you finish. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm just picturing the little white up. Laugh, laugh it up. Too. Laugh it up, <laughs> tan people. Reason. Laugh it up. <laughs> I see Hefe under a, like a, it's got to be a 20 watt bulb. Mm-hmm. <laughs> a lamp. Yeah. Seven foot away. With a, of course, with a shade on it. Right. <laughs> For some reason, the room has Wayne's coating. <laughs> okay, I see. And it. he's just sitting there, and this is where it gets hard. He's in tidy whities <laughs> but he's got his he's got his left arm outstretched with a tiny, tiny brush, <laughs> looking yeah. looking like uh, mm-hmm. someone someone that is is mm-hmm. painting like one of those mm-hmm. miniature iron army men things. <laughs> And getting ready to place it upon his village for the for the Franklin Mint, yes, <laughs> for the chess pieces. That there's your visual this morning coming up for you this morning at six forty. Norm McDonald uh, passed away. Man, that that one's oh, that's hard mm-hmm. for me. We'll talk about that. And someone's injured. Uh, thanks to Kevin Hart and Mark Wahlberg. We'll tell you what. Next. Ask for money and get advice. Ask for advice. You know what I picture? Because I was up. I was with you all the way up to that point. Tidy whities in a chair. Yeah. For some reason, had handles or like arm, like rests right here. Okay, first I thought you said the tidy Legs whities crossed. had handles. <laughs> At the ankle, oddly enough, but surrounded by empty whiteout bottles. But then for some like reason. 75 of them. Yeah. Okay. Some reason Bob Ross is also in the corner <laughs> reminding him like. There are no happy mistakes. little trees. There are no mistakes. Just, just happy <laughs> opportunities. You're a happy little ginger. You're, you're a happy little. Ginger. We'll paint a little happy ginger over here in the corner. <laughs> yeah, those. That's that's where and my. He's got Bob Ross. Has got his landscape up there, and he just walks over to you, grabs the. the I just need this for a moment. <laughs> Put a happy little ginger right here. In the corner. Then you just see him dip the brush. And Love Bob Ross, man. I know. Talk about Bob Ross. That is Bob Ross. That is binge watching that you're about you're about four hours into before you're going, Whoa, I gotta move. Yeah. That's some cool well, stuff. Well, but didn't they have a documentary out from yeah, him? It has really nothing to do with Bob. It has to do with oh. people that ran. I fell asleep during that. Yeah. That's disappointing. I watched uh, the girls and I watched a documentary on Hulu about Nickelodeon. And the creation of Nickelodeon and all the shows, so fun. Would really? not have Nickelodeon were it not for Canada. Correct. I mean, that, that was that was just... Yeah. You can't do that on TV. And I remember. Television. Or television. Yeah, thank you. Um. <laughs> Where'd you get... Where was this documentary? Where can I find it? Hulu. Really? hmm Yeah. If you see it, will you send me a link? Out? Absolutely. Nickelodeon, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> Because that's right in my wheelhouse. That's right when we got cable. Yeah, same. So I was there yep. for You Can't Do That on Danger Mouse. 
Oh, yes. Now, there's a oh. lot of stuff on Nickelodeon. Well, Hey Dude and Salute Your Shorts. Mm -hmm. um, that's, that's... That was probably a little after you, but right. I remember Nickelodeon before Nick at Night. Okay. That's a... Yeah. So you're yeah. saying Nickelodeon's from Canada? Yeah. Is it oh. like Second City stuff? Actually, it was a cable channel. Um, well, out of it? Illinois or some <clears throat> small, I, I mean, some uh, state that you, I get, you, it wasn't like California or mm -hmm. New York, but they were looking for shows specifically related to just kids. And they would look for shows from other countries and then dub them in English. Um, you can't do that on television from Canada was their first huge big mm -hmm. hit. That's where the is, slime came from. Is that yeah. where the Rugrats were Rugrats or Nickelodeon? Yep, Rugrats, Doug. Um, but the, it's the story behind the writers and the artists. Um, I have to look that up. Really, really good. If you find it, send it to Bo. Yeah, I will. Unless you're just making this up. No, no. Nope, true story. I can't wait to watch it. Oh, now I have to find all of them. <laughs> I'm Never done. I, I just got to take the rest of the day off. <laughs> I'm going to go home and watch this documentary. I love a documentary. Yeah, I figured you would. You love a documentary as much as you do a study. Yes. Yeah. Y yes. Yes. What is HP1? Is it just a norm drop? It is, yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> He was a comedian's comedian. So shut up now. <laughs> Save it. Save it. Save it. Save it. Love the Jeopardies, though. There's so many. The oh, Sean good. Connery, yeah. Sean Connery's were great on there. Shock at your back. <laughs> so I slept wrong a couple weeks ago, and my neck has been. Really? Ugh. Ever since? Yes. So it yesterday in month. What is today? Wednesday. Yesterday and Monday felt good. I was blow drying my hair and flipped it back up. I'll teach you, Black Widow. And I was like, oh no. And you're like, Black Hawk down, Black Hawk down. <laughs> I was, I was, oh, ow, ow, ow. Oh, stupid. That is Jenny. a sign of old age when you start out with, mm -hmm. I was blow drying my hair and then I whipped my head. I whip my hair back and forth. I whip my hair back and forth. I whip my. Uh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not cool enough to pull that off anymore. Thanks. Thirty-eight. <laughs> Ooh, real pitchy there, dog. Sorry, it's my alarm every morning. <laughs> Is it? No. Oh. Should are you be. legally oh. obligated to do so? That's tremendous if, it, if you are. That would be so great. We interrupt this program to bring you this. What is this? This is where the entertainment is. This is the Kid 105.3 Hollywood Beat with Jenny Lewis. Oh, All right, kid, tell me what is trending in Hollywood. The comedy world is reacting to the... Sad news that oh. Norm MacDonald passed away at the age of 61 years old. Turns out he actually battled a nine-year uh, time with cancer. And and it was private. He kept it very, very private. No one, you know, maybe close family knew about it, but no one else knew that he battled with cancer. There are actors, actors, and Sean Penn, I guess it would be considered an actor's actor. Who played Lincoln? Who uh, Daniel Day-Lewis oh, is an actor's yes. actor. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, uh, Anthony Hopkins is an mm -hmm. actor's actor. The list goes on and on. And there's uh, Dame Judi Dench is considered an actress's actress or an actor's actor, whatever you want to say there. Just want to make sure, uh, sure I get them all in there because there's so many of them. I guess I can't get them all in. But Norm MacDonald was a comedian's comedian. He would make, if you go to a comedy club, I want you to pay attention the next time you go. There's one table that doesn't react to much, but when nobody else reacts, that table reacts, 
that those are your comedians that are there. Right. And Norm oh. MacDonald, the thing that he did so well and just didn't care, he played to the comics table. Hmm. Watch wow. Norm MacDonald on a roast, on a Comedy Central roast, mm -hmm. when he did Bob Saget's roast. Oh. The audience never laughed, but everyone on stage was dying. What? I, yeah, that makes me want to go back and watch it. Of course, Norm MacDonald, Saturday Night Live, Billy Madison, Family Guy. I mean, his creds are a mile long. So mm -hmm. incredibly talented. Here's one of his jokes. Hey, this occurred to me today. Uh, ID, ID, which I had to show it again. There's a strange abbreviation when you think about it. I is short for I. <laughs> And then D is short for dentification. <laughs> <laughs> but that was his type of humor. It was very dry. It was just so good. The worst Burt Reynolds impersonation, but the best, <laughs> the best. Burt Reynolds. Mr. Reynolds, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, I found this backstage, uh, oversized hat. It's funny. No, it's not. Sure it is. It's funny. It's funny because it's uh, bigger than a you know, normal hat. I, I see that. Get back to your podium. <laughs> Take a look at that. Yeah, I see it. Go back to your podium. It's not I loved him. <laughs> I absolutely loved him. One of the funniest comedians you'll ever see, Norm MacDonald, dead at the age of 61 today. There was a crew member that was seriously injured on the set of the new Netflix film called Me Time with Kevin Hart and Mar Mark Wahlberg. Was it Norm MacDonald? Well, no, it was oh. not. No. Um, so it turns out they actually had to call 911 yesterday morning because he fell so far from the platform. It's a good call. Well, I... than calling somebody else. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> now, the man's condition remains unknown at this time, but I was just wondering, I mean, if he was on a platform, where was Kevin Hart standing to do, to do their takes? Because he usually is. Because he's so little. Wow. He's so little. Ouch. <laughs> I mean, he was just... <laughs> She's got just some cracking, water herself, over here. cracking herself up over here today. <laughs> I'm not laughing at the injury. I'm just... I'm envisioning Kevin Hart going, oops. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. That's so she's, she's so pretty. <laughs> she's stuck out. Help is on the way here. Jenny Lewis. Help is on the way the K105.3 Morning Show. Run. Thirsty for a margarita and can't decide what flavor to get? Problem solved with margarita flights from the Crazy Cowboy. 14 different flavors to choose from. Hungry? Build your own burrito or burger and give their barbecue pulled pork a try. Smoke low and slow. It's all you can eat tacos on Thursdays at the Crazy Cowboy. Fun family restaurant with patio seating available. Check out the Crazy Cowboy on Facebook for daily specials. Crazy Cowboy, Mechanic Street, downtown Jackson. Come into Bell Tire today. You'll get the lowest tire price, period. Like up to $150 off select sets of four Goodyear tires. You'll also get a guy who will give you free lifetime flat repairs, tire rotations, and alignment checks. Get up to $150 off select sets of four Goodyear tires, plus more free services and more out of your tires and more for your money. It's how we make the lowest tire price feel even lower at Bell Tire. See store at belltire.com for details and offer expiration. It's 645, and maybe you're thinking about lunch if you are. Kelly Express Mart's got a great deal for you today. At the Jefferson Road location of Kelly Express Mart, they've got Coney Dogs for just $1.99. That is convenience and customer service above the rest. Always shop Kelly Express. Hey, folks, it's Dave Ramsey here for Jim Winter Auto Group. If you listen to our show, you know that thousands of people around Jackson are driving cars they can't afford. Rolling around town under hundreds of dollars a month in purchase or lease payments on more car than they really need. In this day and age, that kind of extra debt is keeping the average family from getting where they want to be in life. The good news is used vehicle values are at an all-time high. If you haven't checked out what your car is worth lately, see my friends at Jim Winter Auto Group. Chances are Jim Winter can get you out of your payments whether you own or lease it. And right now, you can probably find one of those cash vehicles I'm always telling you about on the Jim Winter pre-owned lot. Come in to Jim Winter Auto Group today for a free, no obligation, buyout quote on your car and tell them Dave sent you. Online at Jim Winter 
ChristianAuto.com. Jackson Public Schools, better than ever. District-wide building additions and improvements, 21st century learning furniture, added safety and security measures, and technology advancements for every classroom. All part of Jackson Public Schools' continued commitment to our students and our community. We are dedicated to providing our students the tools and environment to succeed. There is no better place for our students to learn than in person at Jackson Public Schools. Jackson Public Schools, bringing our community together to build a culture of academic excellence and workforce readiness. Go Vikings. Birthday's on the way at 652. Right now, your forecast brought to you by Jackson Public Schools. Where community comes together. High today, 76. Low tonight, 53. 79, the high for tomorrow. Partly sunny conditions for the day today. Partly cloudy overnight and mostly sunny tomorrow. We're at 61. Singing, oh, oh, oh. Manu, manu. <laughs> do, 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 do. You can't do that without another hand. Uh, that sticks with you all day. You start <laughs> then you realize you're just in your own world dancing and singing it to yourself. Yeah, there are people are staring. Yeah, well, yeah, that too. Here's my, you ever heard my ringtone? Nobody has because I never play it. Or it was this one. Oh, uh, nice. I like that one. Uh, I like see, it. I'm not hip enough to have stuff like that. <clears throat> or it could be Steve Austin. I just want that playing whenever I walk into a room. <laughs> you just have somebody call you? Yeah. <laughs> so you can just go. Yeah, but would you come in and go, you rang? <laughs> yes. You rang? What? You rang, like what? a butler? What? You rang? Oh, yeah. Didn't they say that on Adam's Family? Yes. So you're saying I look like Lurch? No. I'm just wow. saying that if you had someone call... No, I first really it's, wasn't. First, it's the no hair thing. No. I was going Stone Cold Steve Austin by playing that. And yeah. she's all of a sudden putting me into first butler category. No, no, no. Now no. it's no hair. No. And now you're, no, 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 no. Oh, now true you're, you're, feelings are now shining. Now it's a, you're a tall lurch. Yep. Yep. No, that's not what I... You tall, can't put words in my mouth. Low butler. Yep. <laughs> with that one arm, that's with that one knuckle dragging on the ground. <laughs> you said two <laughs> things. You rang and... <laughs> You know what? He had it figured out. <laughs> Maybe that's, that's my next job is butler. What? <laughs> you want tea? First you take that little bell and you're like. Mm -hmm. Here's the way it's going to work, Gretchen. <laughs> you're going to stop ringing that bell. And I'm going back to watching my story. <laughs> When's Yellowstone coming out? Are you guys all caught uh, up on not, Yellowstone? No, I'm not caught up. I am not. It, I'm sorry, it just got, it became Dallas. No, 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 no. Oh, you're right, because it's not about a family trying to maintain power that's had power for several years, and there's one daughter that does some really underhanded stuff and one weaselly kid that the dad has to keep out of trouble and a dad that's done questionable things but is willing to screw over local landowners so that he can maintain. It's nothing like it. <laughs> I wish I had well, popcorn. Well, now that you put it that way. <laughs> I wish, wish I had popcorn for this. And has Kevin Costner been shot yet? Watch the season finale from last year. Who shot Kevin Co Who shot JR? We don't know. <laughs> exactly. Right. <laughs> it's Dallas. <laughs> wow. There you go. L. King, Miranda Lambert, K105.3, Jackson Jeez. Zip Music so, Station. I'm so, sorry. The that's likes just the you case. go to prove a point. <laughs> wow. Okay. I'll prove it again. Nope, oh, no, I said point. No, no, no. Once is enough. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Once.
still missing out on my popcorn, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's your, that's your favorite thing is when they turn on each other. It is. I love it. <laughs> then you got to open your mouth. And then we remember, oh, Jenny's here. <laughs> We'll get Jenny. <laughs> Happy birthday to our K-Club members from Jack60. Hey, listen, bowling leagues are happening right now. And if you'd like to spend time with your friends but not do a whole lot of talking, I recommend bowling. Perfect outing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pull the chain. Yep. Yeah. No Next. chains anymore. There's buttons. Oh, yeah. I push the button. No, I push the button. I push the we button. We need to have ourselves a little field trip for bowling as well. Yeah, well, if we let Jenny know, we'll plan it for 7. We'll tell her it's at 5. <laughs> that way she'll be there by 7.15. Jenny Light Savings Time. <laughs> Jenny Light Savings Time. Accurate. I know. Happy birthday to our K-Club members, Jamie Spencer, Beverly <laughs> Allen, Jennifer Angle, Jessica Foshi, also Danielle Elrop, Jessica, we got you, Steve Ferency, former... McKibben Media Group employee, happy to you. Happy birthday to you. William Decker, Kim Vinson, Sheena Sparks, Sydney Witter, Jennifer Stinnett, El Cali, and Lori Klein. Happy birthday to you. If your birthday is today, you share it with the following Hollywood dignitary. Reality star Heidi Montag is 35 today. Wow. Royalty Prince Harry is really? 37 years old. Actor Tom Hardy is 44. Actor Josh Charles is 50. Football player Dan Marino is 60 years old. Reality star Lisa Vanderpump is 61. Actor Tommy Lee Jones is 75. And director Oliver Stone is also 75 today. Happy birthday to you from your friends at Jack 60 and all of us right here at K105.3. Wow! Scott Clow. <laughs> Jenny Lewis. <laughs> the K105.3 Morning Show. <laughs> How important is your comfort? We often take for granted that our homes are a welcoming environment without thinking about what makes them that way. This is Tina with Hometown Heating, Cooling, and More with a small investment that will offer you a priceless peace of mind. For just $240 per year, a hometown teammate will visit twice a year to clean and inspect the things that make your house a home. Call Hometown Heating, Cooling, and more, your authorized Daikin dealer, and ask about our protective maintenance plan today. Hello, my name is Joel Cook, and I'm the principal at East Jackson Secondary School. I'm Jeff Punches, assistant principal and athletic director at East Jackson. The recent pandemic has taught us that the traditional way of delivering education simply does not work for today's students. At East Jackson, our focus is not just on standardized test scores. Our focus is on our students. We understand the importance of reading, writing, arithmetic, but we want our students to be able to develop life skills, like balancing a checkbook or changing a tire. While we love utilizing our one-to-one technology, a computer will never replace the value of a classroom teacher or the value of hands-on activities and student-to-student interaction. At EJSS, we want to bring back the school experience. And while we focus strongly on academics, we still love to have dress-up competitions. We have pep assemblies, rap battles. We even have student versus staff dance-offs. Education has changed, and at East Jackson Secondary School, we are changing with it. For more information, please check us out at eastjacksonschools.org or pop in and visit anytime. It's time to fire up the grill with some incredible deals. How about 20 ribeyes for $39.99? Uh, what? You heard me. 20 ribeyes, just $39.99. Prime House Direct is having a gigantic four-day sale. Today through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. Rain or shine. At Menards. 3588 Page Avenue, Jackson. Look for the big truck. And the big tent. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. Cases of fillets. New York strips. No monocos. Homeless chicken breast. And even large shrimp. With wholesale boxes of individual prime portions. That gives sealed for long freezer life. Bundle up deals that include a free freezer while supplies last. Accepting cash, credit, debit card, and DBT. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. Stop by and register to win our $1,000 prime steak, chicken, pork, and seafood package along with a free freezer. No purchase necessary. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. At Menards. 3588 Page Avenue, Jackson. Today through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. Rain or shine. Art Main Chevrolet's service department is open for business, ready and committed to help you. Whether it's for routine maintenance or maybe collision repairs, rest assured that your Chevrolet certified service experts at Art Main Chevrolet are available to handle your vehicle repairs. To schedule an appointment for your vehicle, visit ArtMainChevy.com. Find new roads off I-94, exit 141.
Ideal U knows a lot of people are skeptical about weight loss programs, so they're putting their money where their mouth is. Book your free consultation at idealu.us today and you'll get a free body composition analysis. Plus, they'll give you $100 off the program when you tell them which program failed you in the past. Whatever it is, cabbage soup diet, keto diet, or any program you bought, it doesn't matter. Ideal U will give you $100 off your program. There are no shots, no shakes, and no prepackaged food. Ideal U teaches you how to use real food to lose weight. Act now and you can look the best you have in years long before Halloween. Go to idealu.us and book your free consultation. You'll receive a free body composition analysis and $100 off when you mention any weight loss program that has failed you. That's idealu.us. Results may vary based on physical health and adherence to the program. No weight loss or health guarantees are provided or implied. Welcome back, everybody in Facebook land. It's good to see you. Glad you're here. That's Hefe Kinsel. We've adjusted the white balance in that corner. Yeah, dim the lights just a little bit. It's a little bright, but... <laughs> Let's say kept... Okay. Go ahead. What if there were terrariums for gingers? What would be in a ginger terrarium? <laughs> Obviously, it's not like... It's like the inverse of a lizard. Because you don't want the heat lamp. No, no, no. heat lamp. You'd have a corner... That you would have heat because kids you'd have to go over and warm up, okay. but not a full line heat lamp. Okay, It'd be like a dry heat, like a sauna, <laughs> Arizona. Okay. I went to, I instantly went to red gingham curtains. You can't have red plaid everywhere. No, yeah. we don't wear red. It's, no, it you don't wear red, but you can have it up on your curtains. <laughs> That's all I think of. And how do you know? <laughs> okay, you don't set the rules for this. You're not allowed in the meetings. I'm way sure of that. Ooh, we've got ginger no, spice happening. Little, little sunset background in the back of the, in the terrarium. Okay. But drawn on. Right. Yes. With uh, cloud cover. Sure. <laughs> so It's all pastels, so it's not too bright. What a lot of people don't know Watercolors. is that the... Uh, <laughs> There are proud gingers everywhere, every continent. Matter of fact, one of the former emperors of Japan was, in fact, a ginger. Mm. And a lot of people don't realize it. The Japanese flag is actually a, a portrait of him. It's just, wow. Against a white background. Against a white background. A lot of people just think it's a big red dot. Nope, it's just him. It's actually wow. a portrait of the flag. Come in today. I gotta get three weeks worth all in one day. It's, it's, it's great. It's a build up. It's great. I love it. <laughs> Next week will be totally different. Nope, I love it. Bring it. You know I can take it. <sighs> Stretch out for it. No, don't blow a hammy. But there are National Redhead Days, which I really would love to go to. There's giant festivals. Each year. Yes, they are on cloudy days. In- Fancy light. Jackson's hit music. WKHM FM HD1, Brooklyn Jackson. Live from the Art Main Chevrolet Studio. This is hour two of the K105.3 Morning Show. K105.3 News Now. In the WKHM News Center, I'm Jenny Lewis. The Jackson City Council met last night and voted down the first reading of an aggressive solicitation ordinance in a five to two vote. The ordinance was intended to curb panhandling in Jackson. The first step to getting a police oversight commission for Jackson was approved by the City Council last night. A second reading of an ordinance to officially create the commission will be considered at a future meeting. The City of Jackson with the Jackson Public Schools will be holding a ribbon-cutting ceremony this Friday at 11.30 a.m. for the refurbished pedestrian trail along Emdale Drive. Aaron Dimmick, Communication Director for the City, on WKHM Tuesday, said things will be much safer. We wanted to improve that trail, create a safer walk to school, so it is great for the students, but it's also really great for residents. It's kind of giving them another exercise option and improving that trail. Communication Director for the City, Aaron Dimmick. 
FEMA says that it has approved nearly $205 million to help Michiganders following the late June storms, tornadoes, and flooding in the two months since President Joe Biden declared a major disaster in Washtenaw and Wayne counties. Almost 42,000 homeowners and renters received more than $122 million in individual assistance grants to help pay for losses and storm damage. Anyone still in need of federal assistance has until October 13th to register. A new delivery service for Kroger. The grocery store chain and Instacart are teaming up, promising grocery deliveries in as little as 30 minutes. It'll be called Kroger Delivery Now. Kroger and Instacart first partnered in 2017 with a two-hour grocery delivery. News and sports powered by WKHM and WKHM.com. I'm Jenny Lewis. It's worth talking to the experts, Kristoff and Son. Hi, this is Ted Kristoff from Kristoff & Sons Floor Covering and Design Center. Many people don't know that we are a design center for the home. In addition to having the largest selection of flooring and ceramic tile, we also have kitchen cabinets, countertops, sinks, faucets, bathroom vanities, window treatments, drapes, shutters, wallpaper, and area rugs. All of this under one roof with professional designers ready to create the space that you will love. From one room to the whole house, we can help you make your decorating dreams come true. Stop in sometime and take a look. You will be amazed. We are conveniently located in downtown Jackson at 400 North Mechanic Street. It's worth talking to the experts, Christoph and Sons. One, two, three. All of your fall favorites are at your favorite Big B Coffees. Parnell, Springport Road, Cooper Street. Stop in and enjoy a pumpkin spice latte. Or a maple waffle sandwich, caramel apple cider, sweet foam pumpkin cold brew, sparkling cider, zip mocktail, and don't forget about free shop Fridays at your Big B Coffees on Parnell, Springport Road, Cooper Street. Be happy this fall with Big B Coffee. All right, your news update brought to you by Colin, or excuse me, Christoph and Sons Floor Covering. Christoph and Sons Floor Covering is your one-stop shop for kitchen and bath remodeling. They've got cabinets, countertops, sinks, faucets, flooring, you name it, Christoph and Sons can help you design your full kitchen. Check them out at Christophs.com or stop downtown. I will, Round Jenny. One. By the way, Sports Now Five. brought to you by the Bigby Coffees of Albion, Eaton Rapids, Jonesville, Cooper Street. Don't forget about the new one coming to Cooper and North. And as you're heading out to that uh, job fair tomorrow with the Michigan Department of Corrections, you can stop by the Parnell, their newest location of Bigby Coffee, and get yourself some caramel apple cider. Mm, num nums. Num nums for you. Uh, Tigers pick up a big win. One to nothing win over the Brewers yesterday. High school football action coming up for you on our airwaves. Down the hallway, Friday Night Lights, Ypsilanti, 0-3, goes against Jackson, coming in at 1-2. Live coverage, 7 o'clock, WKHM, Jackson's News Talk, 970 AM, 101.5 FM. And here on K105.3, 1-2 Hanover Horton travels to 1-2 Grass Lake, live coverage, 7 o'clock. There you go, there's your sports. Let's do your forecast now. It's brought to you by Granger Way Services of Jackson. They'll think about your waste so you don't have to. And frankly, no one wants to think about their waste, my waste, Jenny's waste, no. anybody's waste. No, not if you don't have to. No, you don't want to do that. Mm-mm. That's not what you want to do. High today, 76. Low tonight, 53. And tomorrow's high, 79. Partly sunny today, partly cloudy tonight, and mostly sunny for your tomorrow. Currently in Jackson, fair sky, 61 degrees. Coming up for you this morning, we're going to say it's 710. We're going to hear about Jenny Lewis's T-shirt Pinterest project. Oh, no. Yeah, there is one. And whether or not... You had me at Pinterest. <laughs> it's cute enough. I'm sorry. Cute. Huh? Whether or not it's cute enough. Cute. To wear to the Luke Bryan concert, everybody. I'm Luke Bryan. Yay! <laughs> Buzzy bear. 710. Don't miss out. 
There aren't enough minutes in the day. Do you really want to spend any of them worrying about your trash service? With Granger Waste Services, you don't have to. You need a service provider that's reliable with convenient, time saving online options for payment and communication. Granger Waste Services has you covered. Start using Granger Waste Services. Stop thinking about your trash. Sign up today at GrangerWasteServices.com or 888 947 2643. Granger Waste Services. They'll think about your waste. So you don't have to. Scott Cloud, Jenny Lewis, the K105.3 Morning Show. Have you ever met (laughs) any... Oh, no. Write that down. You're going to have to write me a note for that last hour. You're going to have to stay. Yep, there are seven people in your office waiting to see you. Let's hope no jerks. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. That scene from Airplane, uh, where Robert Stack's walking into the airport and he's being accosted by everybody. I played that for Jenny. She's not seen Airplane. I have. You don't remember that scene, though. You haven't seen it enough. Right. I didn't remember that scene when you, you showed it to me. You, you saw it, but you didn't watch it? Probably. Watch it, but you didn't saw it? Right. Kind of like I do football. But that would be akin to a service manager walking out of his office. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and it was also akin to Jenny Lewis as our production director. Jenny makes all of our commercials now, and, and that would be akin to her walking out of the studio <laughs> at about 9 a.m. There's... Having to go to the bathroom so bad. Just a second. Just a second. Hold that. You're going to have to hold on. Because <laughs> I can't. Because I've been. Yeah. See, that's where you got to see. And that's why everyone thinks I'm a jerk. But I got to go pee. Yeah. I just tell them what I got to do. Right. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but because we're in the same. In your mind, you're like, all right, right after I do this, yeah. I'm going to go pee. Yes. And then you're like, oh, just a second. All right, then, right after I do this, I got to go. Right. And then after a while, you're. Well, you missed your window. You're well, potty, you're and potty then dancing. Four yeah. hours later, you're like, I, "Have I gone to the bathroom yet today?" Well, then you're like, "I better get some cranberry juice." Right? There's going to be an infection. <laughs> that, or we got some mess to clean up here in Al <laughs> <aisle> Five. <laughs> you know, that's, that's so warm. <laughs> Wait. Okay. What was it you needed? <laughs> Part when I get sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> oh no I like the little foam tripod there whatever mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. we have all sizes we got cool stuff in here yeah somebody clearly thinks so they're messing with the cameras I think they're messing with my cameras mm, you got to set up a camera to watch the camera oh Camilla Cabello, don't go yet. Jackson's hit music, K105.3. Welcome. Don't go anywhere. It's Scott Cloud, Jenny Lewis, and Hefe Kinsel. Good morning, Hefe. Good morning, sir. Jenny Lewis, I'm going to start right off. I want to get into it because I know it's going to take a while. Jenny Lewis is going to the Luke Bryan. Luke Bryan concert, everybody. Yay! <laughs> it's the Muppet Show <laughs> with special guest me. I mean, Luke Bryan. <laughs> Yay! Anyway, you're going to the Luke Bryan Show. I am. Yep. Someone intentionally paid money to go see this train wreck. Uh, Correct. You can watch it on Disney Plus. They have all the Muppet shows on there. You can watch them right there <laughs> for free with Mark Hamill and the rest of the cast from Star Wars. <laughs> but anyway, you're paying money. Yes. Uh, it wasn't. You didn't lose a bet, but you're no. going to Luke Bryan, and you want to look. A bet. You want to wear a cute outfit. I do so want to wear a cute in the outfit. Event when Wait. Luke Bryan looks out and goes, "Oh, hey, Jenny Lewis is here. What's well, she wearing?" I mean, right. You, you never so. know. You saw a cute shirt on Pinterest. Tell me about the shirt and then tell me about your project last night. Please and thank you. I'm going to be quiet. All right, sit All right. back and wait. Okay, so first and foremost, I'd like to start out that I'm wearing white ripped jeans. And it's a red shirt with white lettering. Mm-hmm. And so I saw this cute Pinterest hack where you can kind of distress the shirt a little bit. It's just a t-shirt. Uh, and so you cut off the collar part, the neckline here. And you stretch it out a little bit, and uh, I, I'm going to do something with the sleeves. I cut it so they're, it's kind of like a V-neck a little bit, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and uh, I'm really happy with where it's at right now. Now, there's more things I want to do with the sleeves. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, wait a minute. What more things can you do with the sleeves? 
well. Did you already cut them off? Nope, not yet. Because I, I either I'm going to do what a do you bow. Mean there's more things you have to do something. I, to the well, sleeve. so I, it's not there's more things. So you I haven't done anything. I cut I cut the sleeves off a little bit because the t-shirt I got it a little I bit didn't, bigger. I just ask if you cut the. So shirt. Yeah, you did. Okay, I, so I, I, I want to cut them a little, a little bit, bit more. I thought I did because I was there when I said it. Yeah, but, and I was here and, okay. and it recorded right over okay. here. I've I got okay. it. Okay. So right. I, I want to cut the sleeves a little bit more because I feel like they're still too long. However, I was looking for more Pinterest hacks, and I can make the sleeves into a bow. And I'm really digging this idea. I haven't done it yet because I really like the shirt. And I feel like, you know, sometimes, sometimes I, I might go a little too far. Well, okay. Mm-hmm. Listen Sometimes. to this. Little, right. Just a little Stop. bit too far. I, I think okay. that's in the rear view mirror. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> what color is this shirt again? Red. Okay, so you're going to take a red shirt with white pants. Yes. You're going, you've cut off the sleeves. You've distressed. I have. <laughs> Wait. The neckline. Yes. Distressed. Distressed. Get the yes. Dis- you've distressed the neckline. Uh-huh. Okay. okay. You're going to cut the sleeves a, 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 a little bit more. Correct. Uh-huh. Or, and then maybe you're going to turn the sleeves into a bow. Yes. So basically, Jenny Lewis, mm-hmm. you're going to the Luke Bryan concert as a present. As a, as a as a present that is starting to be unwrapped already. I just I'm a helper, Scott Clow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for you Luke Bryan. You put bows on this. I mean, look. you are a present. You might as well say to and from right on. The, you could do that to the shirt, right? To uh, and from. I mean, you're not wrong. To Luke Bryan, <laughs> from. Jenny Lewis! Yay! Yay! <laughs> I love this idea. I love the idea. Now really? I should put bows on the sleeves. Thank you for confirming what I was really on the fence about. Thank you. Because I really like this shirt. And I, was, I wasn't sure about doing the bows on the sleeve. Because I thought, I don't want to be too much. <laughs> it's, it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> Saturday, October 16th, it's K105.3's first ever Fall Fest and Chili Classic. I've just been handed a bulletin. If you're a vendor who'd like to show Jackson what you got, get your application in now. Visit K1053.com. Up on the live feed, we were a little bit, but comes and goes because it's too long to tell. I'll tell you the girls the best, their best Pinterest thing. And all right, you know, like whenever Stephanie would want to make a Pinterest dinner, you know, she's like, I saw this, and you know, okay, we'll make it. Well, it would always cost three times what it would be if you could go to the best restaurant and go get it, you mm-hmm. know. Okay. And, a bit, and 10 times the mess. Well, they decided they wanted to make their own cleaning products. Oh. I saw these cleaning products, and all three of them were all just geeked about it. We're going we're gonna to make them. So I had to go to the store and, and, and buy all this stuff to mix these cleaning products. So I'm like, okay, let's go do it. So, Did you get popcorn? So they got everything, and they're all like a chemist lab, and they're out there brewing all of this stuff and making it. They were arrested for <laughs> meth? No. Nope. So I come out during the presentation of these <laughs> cleaning products, okay? <laughs> and, and I'm looking, and all this stuff, they're just, they're proud as a new mother. And I'm, I'm looking, and all of this stuff, is is in spray bottles, and I said, "Well, that's cool that you have them in spray bottles. What was you know? Where did you get empty spray bottles like that? No, they weren't empty. We bought them and we just dumped out the stuff that was in the bottles. Hmm. Would that be like cleaning stuff that was in there? Mm-hmm. Oh, there's, there's Windex and all that, but we just dumped it out. Yeah. Oh no." <laughs> Oh no! Uh, um, so you dumped out cleaning supplies to make more cleaning supplies. Cleaning supplies. And this one's what a window cleaner? Yeah, this is a really good streak, no streak window cleaner. Like the stuff you dumped out. <laughs> well, I usually drink a bottle of Windex a month. It just cleans you out. Uh, I, I feel it like makes your glasses, your eyes cleaner. <laughs> I don't want to be arrested for indecent exposure again, and. 
Windex <laughs> prevents streaking. So <laughs> I just Look at me. I drink a bottle of that every month. And <laughs> just as precautionary. Been streak free now for <laughs> <laughs> for years. <sighs> Oh, wall, anybody? anybody oh, man. It? Was it just ran right From up to you? Just to right here. Yes. Just right then. Boom. Mm-hmm. Boom. <sighs> we got this. Morning, Bob. Hola, Bob. Stretch back out. Me llamo Scott. Well, it doesn't help that it's 89 degrees in here. It is sauna-like temperature in here. Did you not get yourself a coffee this morning? I. Are you uncaffeinated? No, I had the the double shot oh. thing. That you had a triple shot. That was a triple. That was a triple. Oh, I had the tall triple. Yes. Oh, I had triple. okay. No, I'm not uncaffeinated. I was like, I just, what is happening over there? Nope. I just that coffee and I are just not friends right now. Ah, uh, gotcha. Wow. I don't know. Is not coffee. In, not coffee in general. Oh, that coffee for okay. some mm-hmm. reason. Really? Yeah. It's about it's the coffee that keeps giving. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's it's about just at random times. Hello. <laughs> Not always at the best time either. <laughs> no. Not that there is a good time. It's, well, it's when you get the sweat. Yeah. The worst time I think would be. <laughs> I'd like to thank the family for letting me speak at <laughs> Bob's, <laughs> Bob's funeral. Oh, Bob was great. We gotta go. Bye. <laughs> All right. Love that Bob. <laughs> Bob Bob love that Bob. <laughs> is Mike still on? Who's next? <laughs> Chris Brown, Forever. It's Jackson's Hip Music, K105.3. And Scott Cloud, Jenny Lewis, Hefe Kinsel here on a Hefe Wednesday. Good morning, Hefe. Good morning, sir. How are you? Oh, I'm fantastic. I'm going to be even better because coming up for you this morning at 735, your chance to call in and win. We're going to win big this morning. We're going to win big really with big. the Family Feud. Ooh. Are you ready? Here win as in F-A. I'm winning. All right, here Jeez, is today's God. Family Feud question. Call in and win 735. People say they're in love. Name something else. People tell you they are in. Top five answers on the board. People say they're in love. Name something else. People tell you they are in. 735 will be your cue to call in and win. 768 hits 768-4448. Up for grabs, 10 free coffees. To Kelly Express Mart. Perfect. People say they are in love. Name something else they say they're in. We'll play at 735. Someone will play with Hefe Kinsel. And win. Someone will play with Jenny Lewis. Mm-hmm. And lose. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wow. For someone who hasn't been here, it's did talking a lot of snack. Just... I did. I don't know why. It what just happened. That? I don't know. I, I really don't. I, I don't know. I did. I, I, Lord, I apologize. I forgot. <laughs> it's okay. I'm a potato. <laughs> so relatable. <laughs> the potato thing? Yeah. You felt like a potato before? Look at me. Today I'm wearing brown. I guess I feel like a potato today, but I'm a potato. <laughs> I'm a potato. Try it. I'm a potato. I'm a potato. One more time. I'm a potato. You're up here. I, I know. Need you right there. <laughs> right, never mind. Let's get back into it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, you're up here. <laughs> I need you to be down here. I'm a potato. In. Oh, boy. How to baby eat something. Burrito. Suave. <laughs> Did she say burrito? Suave. <laughs> <laughs> Such a smooth burrito. <laughs> burrito. <laughs> Suave. This was a mistake. <laughs> Did you say steak? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just having my own thing over here. I'm just happy. You've got what you got there. That's great. Jenny Lewis. So Jenny this Lewis. weekend is this concert? Mm-hmm. So you've only got a few more days to keep messing with this shirt? 
So yeah, but you, again, you, too you, far yeah. is too far. So I got to be real careful. Don't, don't, I'm not going to do the bows, I don't think. Bows. I think I'm just going to leave them cut like I have them. Okay, put bows on it, you will look like a... <clears throat> extra. So like if, I tried too hard. Yeah. yeah. So if you're saying yeah. you dis, you're distressed, so the shirt was already stressed? No, um, the shirt was a, just a normal new t-shirt. Well, wait a minute. Are you in distress? But if you're distressing it... You're insinuating that the shirt was stressed. But you're not listening. She's in this shirt. Not distress. This shirt? This shirt. Not distress. <laughs> Took a second. Ba-doom. Yeah. Thank you very Took much. a second. <laughs> I'll be here. Well, really, I'll probably be fired after that joke. But I'd like to thank everyone. <laughs> the Academy and all those that voted for me. Don't forget the little people. Yep. <laughs> but... I mean, good news, you can go back and watch the documentary. So there you go. Nickelodeon? <laughs> that documentary? Can't wait to watch it. Oh, no. Today's uh, Wednesday. That means new Marvel What If. Oh. Well, there you go. I'm watching cartoons today. You've got a full day. Do you have a TV in your office? Oh, I've got an internet connection. I can watch it from my office, yeah. Not that I've ever done that before. No, never. Not during... No, actually, I haven't done that. That's my get home. Thank you, Sherry. What'd you say? Distress, not de stress. I know, but distress. <laughs> distress, de stress. Are you wearing de stress? <laughs> no. Why, I'm yes. Not. yes. Feel free I to. I did hook up my new extra monitor. Yeah. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Did I'm just going to. Slide that over there. I love that. that you feel cool. a little bit like Tony Stark, don't you? Okay, when I say I hooked up, that means I called and had a backpack come in and do it. Well, sure. Really? You should just called me. Yeah, but had to open it up and put the new little card thingy in there. I don't get, we get all technical fun. on you. Yeah. Put the new card thingy card in? Card thingy in there because the monitors had different cables than the other one. Oh. Had the little blue. I mean, this is right up your nerd alley. I could have had you come in. Scott oh, comes with his own backpack, back, too. You even have a backpack, I know. I do. And lots of cords. In Everybody that. makes fun of my backpack until they need something out of my backpack. Oh, yeah. Then, then they all love my backpack. Then, it's all, oh. then they're looking at me going, do you have your backpack? Right. Ugh. Yeah. Look at Jenny. Guilty. No, she's never. I don't think no. I have. Ed Sheeran, Bad Habits, K105.3, Jackson Sit Music Station. Good morning. It's 724, and we're sitting at 61 degrees. Bus Stop Weather brought to you by the Walton Insurance Group. An independent auto owner's insurance agency. So you are probably in the drop-off line right now. If you are taking a kid to school, you are in the drop-off line. This is the first full week of school. We had three consecutive short weeks. Now we're into the first week of the first five days of kids going to school. Yeah. My question to you, dropping kids off or picking them up, have you picked your parking lot enemy yet? Ooh. Those exist. Oh, yeah, they yes, do. The they pick do. up drop off enemy. Yeah, they Your do. Your arch nemesis. They mm-hmm. are there. Mm-hmm. They are there. Hundred percent. And you, don't truck. forget to roll down your window as they're going in and go. Make good choices. Yes. <laughs> don't forget that. Sing random song lyrics yep, to them exactly. as they go up there. That's the best. I know. <laughs> but honestly, there is this internal competition because I notice it now that I'm picking up. Uh, w- w- I'm picking up the girl now. Um, there is someone that gets there before me, mm. and we battle for the same spot. Sometimes I get it. Sometimes they get it. Mm. Oh. Is there a side eye involved? Oh, there's a side eye. No, there's a smirk. There's a side eye. Sometimes there's not even acknowledgement, but I know they're there, and I don't want to give them the satisfaction of them thinking that I know that they're there, that I was watching for them to be there so right. that I could know if they wow. were there and they could acknowledge the fact that I took the spot first and they didn't get it. I don't want to give them that pleasure. Right. No. Did you follow that? Because I really did. <laughs> I did, too, because I've lived it. Yeah, same. I, I get it. Because there's times when you're like, oh, I got to go. I gotta, right. I, 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 and <laughs> you're then you dropping get, what you're doing. I mean, then you're you're one red light away from not getting that spot. Yeah. Then you are not happy on the way. It's a day ruiner. Or if you get behind them on the way there. But sometimes these people are drop off and pick up ninjas. They're nowhere to be seen. I swear to you, they're parking in a bush. Or they disguise their car. It's camouflage. Or drive something different. They mix it up. Wow. Look at the hate in his eyes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, parking lot frenemy there. Drive a white Bronco. (laughs) (laughs) Let's dance, baby. (laughs) 
The juice is loose. <laughs> Free juice. <laughs> Free juice? <laughs> I'll have a Capri Sun, please. Right, thank yes. you. Oh, it's it like is orange. 726. The show is off the rails. <laughs> 735, your chance to call in and win with the feud. It's a K105.3 morning show. Good morning. Scott Cloud. Mm. Jenny Lewis. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. The K105.3 uh, Morning Show. Uh, Hello, this is Nancy Grabner, president of St. Joseph Mercy Chelsea. Here's a tip from one of our healthcare professionals to help you maintain good health. Hello, I'm Emily Griswold, coordinator of the Chelsea Farmers Market. Did you know the Chelsea Farmers Market was established in the early 1990s by a group of volunteers? Today, the Farmers Market supports over 40 vendors throughout the season. The market promotes healthy eating, being active, connecting with others, and avoiding unhealthy habits. Join us at the Wednesday Market, May through October, from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. at Old US 12 in Maine in the Chelsea State Bank parking lot. Or join us at the Saturday Market, May through October, from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. in downtown Chelsea at the new Palmer Commons. For more information, visit ChelseaFarmersMKT.org. For the Medical Minute, this is Emily Griswold. Discover Remarkable at St. Joseph Mercy Health System. For more information, go to stjoeshealth.org. It's time to fire up the grill with some incredible deals. How about 20 ribeyes for $39.99? Uh, what? You heard me. 20 ribeyes, just $39.99. Prime House Direct is having a gigantic four-day sale. Today through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. Rain or shine at Menards. 3588 Page Avenue, Jackson. Look for the big truck. And the big tent. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. Cases of Malays, New York strips, Delmonico's, homeless chicken breast, and even large shrimp. With wholesale boxes of individual prime portions. That gives sealed for long freezer life. But a lot of deals that include free freezer while supplies last. Accepting cash, credit, debit card, and DBT. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. Stop by and register to win our $1,000 prime steak, chicken, pork, and seafood package along with a free freezer. No purchase necessary. 20 ribeyes, $39.99. At Menards. 3588 Page Avenue, Jackson. Today through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. Rain or shine. The Brothers Outdoor World Gift Shop is a hidden gem right here in Jackson. It has everything you need from home decor and gifts for every occasion. It's like landscaping for the inside. We also host family-friendly monthly events from crafters and car shows to fall festivals with food trucks. Stop in our brand new location at 3055 Springport Road, one mile straight north of Airport Meyer. For more information on events and more, call 768-7400 and like Brothers Outdoor World on Facebook. Ideal U knows a lot of people are skeptical about weight loss programs, so they're putting their money where their mouth is. Book your free consultation at IdealU.us today, and you'll get a free body composition analysis. Plus, they'll give you $100 off the program when you tell them which program failed you in the past. Whatever it is, cabbage soup diet, keto diet, or any program you bought, it doesn't matter. Ideal U will give you $100 off your program. There are no shots, no shakes, and no prepackaged food. Ideal U teaches you how to use real food to lose weight. Act now and you can look the best you have in years long before Halloween. Go to IdealU.us and book your free consultation. You'll receive a free body composition analysis and $100 off when you mention any weight loss program that has failed you. That's IdealU.us. Results may vary based on physical health and adherence to the program. No weight loss or health guarantees are provided or implied. Hello, Jackson. Joel here from Phelps Towing. Sometimes life doesn't always go as planned. Just know, as always, Phelps Towing is here for you. We can tow any type of vehicle, including heavy vehicles like RVs, semis, even motorcycles. We can help you out if you lock yourself out of your car, run out of gas, or if you just need a jump start. Phelps Towing can help you with vehicle relocation, winch outs, and with flatbed or wrecker service. When life doesn't go as planned, call Phelps Towing, 764-1921, 764-1921. Thirsty for a margarita and can't decide what flavor to get? Problem solved with margarita flights from the Crazy Cowboy. 14 different flavors to choose from. Hungry? Build your own burrito or burger and give their barbecue pulled pork a try. Smoke low and slow. It's all-you-can-eat tacos on Thursdays at the 
Crazy Cowboy. Fun family restaurant with patio seating available. Check out the Crazy Cowboy on Facebook for daily specials. Crazy Cowboy, Mechanic Street, downtown Jackson. K105.3 News Now. In the WKHM News Center, I'm Jenny Lewis. The City of Jackson with the Jackson Public Schools will be holding a ribbon-cutting ceremony this Friday at 11.30 a.m. for the refurbished pedestrian trail along Emdale Drive. Aaron Dimmick, Communication Director for the City, on WKHM Tuesday, said things will be much safer. We wanted to improve that trail, create a safer walk to school. So it is great for the students, but it's also really great for residents. It's kind of giving them another exercise option and improving that trail. Communication Director for the City, Aaron Dimmick. A new delivery service for Kroger. The grocery store chain and Instacart are teaming up, promising grocery deliveries in as little as 30 minutes. It'll be called Kroger Delivery Now. Kroger and Instacart first partnered in 2017 with a two-hour grocery delivery. News and sports powered by WKHM and WKHM.com. I'm Jenny Lewis. At Lloyd Ganton Retirement Communities, our goal is to provide care for our residents and their families. That means phone calls and visits are between a mother and a son, a daughter and a father, and not caregiver to patient. We'll take care of the day-to-day so your conversations can be about life and not about care. Our team takes pride in improving your loved one's daily life and yours. From the entire Lloyd Ganton Retirement Community family, thank you for allowing us to care for you. This is Dr. Mary Staley, proud alum of Northwest School's class of 1988. My mother is also a graduate from the first class at Northwest High School in 1960. Success takes root at home and blooms at school. My parents knew they wanted to continue this tradition of education excellence for myself, my brother, and generations to come. Northwest was the solid foundation which allowed me to earn a bachelor's degree from Lyman Briggs College at Michigan State University, a doctorate from the University of Detroit School of Dentistry, and my MBA from MSU. Thank you, Northwest, for the tools to propel my education. Your greatness shines brightly in so many ways throughout our community. Hi, this is Jeff Bontrager, Superintendent of Northwest Community Schools. There's greatness happening in the Mountie Nation. Check us out online at nwschools.org, Facebook, Twitter, or call us at 517-817-4725. We are Northwest Go Mounties. Oh, here we go. Your news update brought to you by the Lloyd Ganton Retirement Communities. And now your forecast brought to you by Northwest Community Schools, the direction of greatness. Go Go Mounties. Mounties. There it is. All right, here we go. Weather-wise for the day today, not too shabby of a day. We'll top out around 76 degrees, I believe. Yeah, that's what it's going to be. I was right. Partly sunny skies, partly cloudy tonight. Overnight low 53 and mostly sunny tomorrow with a high reaching 79 degrees currently in Jackson. We'll call it fair skies. Can we call it fair skies? We that's, can. We that's, can call it whatever we want. Well, that's fair. That's <laughs> fair. We're at 61 <laughs> degrees. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to play The Feud. Call 768-4-HITS. That's 768-4448. The Family Feud on Jackson's Hit Music, K105.3. All right, here we go. Let's meet our first contestant. Good morning, K105.3. Who's this? Brandy. Brandy, how are you this morning, Brandy? Doing well. All right, Brandy, it's your choice right now. We need one more contestant, 768-4-HIT, 768-4448. Brandy, who would you like to play with this morning? Would you like to play with Jenny Lewis, or would you like to play with Hefe Kinsel? And when? <laughs> We're going to go with Hefe. All, all right. right. All wow. Right. Let him influence you, Brandy. I love you, Jenny, but... I love you. Well, Maybe a little less much. this morning. No, I'm kidding, Brandy. I love you. 7684-HIT. 768-4448. Today's Family Feud question. Top five answers on the board. The question... People say they're in love. Name something else people tell you they are in. 768-4HIT, 768-4448 to play along with Jenny. Up for grabs, 10 free coffees to from Kelly Express Mart. Your morning stop. That was where Hefe stopped this morning. And Chuck said to tell you hi. Aww, Chuck oh, at hey the Horton Chuck. Road. The best yep. bathrooms in the business. Yep. All right, so, Jenny, no one wants to play with you. Hefe's oh, taken, so I think no. that's what, what happened there. Oh, I think that's no. what just transpired. Jenny. Someone looked at the scoreboard and said... Uh, they were like, mm, not a chance. I need help, you guys. I need help. Please help me. 
Oh, here they go. Hey, good morning. <laughs> Who's this? Hello, K105.3. Hey, good morning. Blink Hi, twice. Who, who's this? This is Angie. How All are right. you? Angie, Angie, great. All right, Angie, you're going to play with Jenny this morning. Here we go. This is Angie. Uh, and you're, is it still You're going to play with Angie this morning, or you're going to play with Jenny and yourself this morning. You, you, you will be a team. That's what it will be. All right. Here we go. Angie, Jenny, we asked 100 people. People say they're in love. Name something else people tell you they are in. What do you think? Angie? In trouble. In trouble. Perfect. In trouble. I love right. this. Number one. Show me in trouble. Number two answer. Whoa. In trouble. So that means we go over to Brandy and Hefe. People say they are in love. Name something else. People tell you they are in. Number two answer is trouble. What do you think, Brandy? That was the one that I was thinking. Of yeah, first. I know this is actually a tough one. It is. But what about. It is. I'm sorry? You said it is. No, I was saying it yeah. is. How about in the mood? In the mood. Oh, I like that one. That you are one. Yeah. in the mood. In the mood. In the mood. Something you're in. Show me in the mood. Yes, in the wow. mood. Yes. Or in lust is the number three answer. Whoa. So you got the number three answer. That means that Angie and Jenny, it's your choice. Would you like to play or would you like to pass, Angie? Oh, I'm not feeling comfortable on this one, Jen. What do you think? I think we pass. All right. We're yes. passing. We lock it in. Back over to Brandy and Hefe. All right, Brandy. People say they are in love. Name something else people say they are in. Number two answer, trouble. And the number three answer, in the mood or in lust. You have anything else in mind, Brandy? <laughs> um, in mind. No, I'm always in deep crap, and that's still trouble, so I'm not sure. Um <laughs> How about the only other thing that I have is like inside, like in the house or indoors or, you know, I don't know how. What do you think, Brandy? You want to go with that? Yeah, I might as well, because I was going to say in the doghouse. But again, that's in trouble. So, so what is, <laughs> yeah, what is inside? Inside. You're inside. Show me inside. No, that is not it. Sorry. I'm so sorry. You didn't win, Brandy, but we had a lot of fun playing you with you. That means... Our winner this morning is Jenny Lewis and Angie. Angie, congratulations to you. You've got 10 free coffees to Kelly Express Mart. All right. Way to go, All Angie. Right. Angie, hang on the line. Let's take a look at the remaining answers. The number one answer to people say they are in love. Name something else. People tell you they are in. Number one answer, debt. Yeah, that was mine. In, yep. I'm in uh, debt. Yeah, or yeah. how about the number four answer in pain? Oh. Nope. And the number five answer in denial. Huh. Okay. There we go. So wow. congratulations, wow. Angie. One. What station just made you a winner? K105.3, baby. Yeah, that's it. Put your loving hand out, baby. Oh, All right, so Angie, what is your last name? Patton, P-A-T-T-O-N. One more time. Say that again. Patton. Okay. P-A-T-T-O-N. All right. Angie Patton, this uh, prize package waiting for you here at the radio station. You can pick it up anytime between 9 and 5, Monday through Friday. You have 30 days to pick it up and 30 days before um, you can win another minor prize. The problem is I work out of town and I'm gone from 7 to 6, so I'll never get it. Well, you're welcome to send somebody else in for it. Just have them give your name. Okay. That'll work. Okay. Angie, thank you so much. Thanks, thank Angie. You. Have a have great day, Have a great day. day. We love, all right, we love you. Okay. Bye, Angie. We love you. Make good choices. Anytime I see you, let me know about the plan and see just let me. Hmm? All right, kids. That is going to do it for the live show. Say goodbye, Hefe. Goodbye, Hefe. Say goodbye, Jenny. Goodbye, Jenny. Everybody have a great day. 